So hello there and welcome back to the channel. This is Mouse Gaming here with another Way of the Hunter video. Now this video is going to be a little bit of a different one. Now on screen you're going to see several images of one particular bull moose. Now this is why it's been a while since my last Way of the Hunter video as I have been following one particular bull moose since he was a two star adult as I believed this bull moose had the potential to become a five star mature. Now, I managed to actually keep up with this bull fairly regularly, and I was taking loads of pictures as he matured, basically. And I was really, really excited. I thought this bull really did have a chance at being my first ever five-star moose, which is something I really wanted to find in Way of the Hunter. The five-star moose look absolutely incredible. And this was actually my first time ever seeing a four-star mature moose, so this was really awesome. And I was thinking, okay, he's a four-star mature now, if he's going to turn into a five star, if he does have that potential, it could happen pretty soon. And I was still playing the game, doing other things, going through and culling off poorer individuals of other species and poorer individuals of moose as well in this area. And I figured that just a couple of times I'd drive back through where I knew he was hanging out, his particular sort of territory, and just check and see if he had grown at all. And eventually I come through and he is a five star mature. Oh my, I was so amazed by just how awesome these things look in game. I've seen pictures, I've seen videos of five star mature moose in this game, but finally seeing one for myself, he's just breathtaking, absolutely beautiful, so incredible looking. Those huge palms, what a beast of an animal. And it felt just a little bit extra cool just because I had been watching this particular bull for so long. I'd been documenting his existence on my map since he was a two-star adult. I saw him go from a two-star adult to a three-star adult to a four-star mature and now finally reaching his max potential and becoming a five-star mature. That was so awesome. And I really can't think of another way to describe it other than awesome and cool because it really, it just was. Getting to watch an animal like this and actually see them age is something that I absolutely love about Way of the Hunter and it doesn't get old to me. Now, took a shot at him there with the 338 Lepore. I was pretty sure that that was a solid double lung shot and that he wouldn't go far before he actually went down. I'm just keeping an eye on him here to see where he actually goes and you'll see he doesn't actually end up going very far before he actually lies down to expire. And that was quite a moment. Because it was like, finally, after all this time, taking this moose, it felt really rewarding that I'd actually chosen the right one to, to keep up with. You know, that taking all those pictures and everything and waiting for him to become a five star, it was all worth it. And I really don't know how else to say it other than it was just extra special to have a five star that I had watched grow from a two star adult all the way through into becoming a five star. It just made the experience so much more complete for me. And this is what I absolutely love about Way of the Hunter. I think it is absolutely fantastic. Now, in a moment, we're gonna be talking about something that was a little bit less positive about this entire experience. And I don't want anyone to think that I am in any way bashing the game or anything like that because I am not and I think you can probably tell by the fact that I was just saying this is what I love about this game but unfortunately something really rather sad ended up making this experience less than what it should have been. I was super excited to finally have a five star moose to put into the lodge to to show off in a video to all of you because I think these are one of the coolest looking five stars in the game and I couldn't wait to record one and you know show it to you all and then I pick him up and I see this it said that when he was by the looks of it a two-star adult I had apparently shot it in the back leg in through the artery with the 300 and then I scroll across to the overview screen and my heart just sank the information as you can see in the animal info it's for a male mature 98.11% moose, but you can see the picture there on the left hand side is of him as a two star and it also says that it was a trophy rating of a two star. I don't remember ever taking a shot at this moose when it was a two star adult because as I just said, 
from the moment that I saw this moose, I knew he had potential, so I didn't shoot at it. The only thing that I can think maybe happened, because I would never take a shot like that either, like, into its back leg. The only thing I can maybe think is I took a shot at another moose and he was in a bush or something behind it and the shot missed and maybe it hit him. But, you know, that's quite, you know, I don't think that happened, honestly, but it's the only thing I can think. And then scrolling across to the trophy screen, it shows his score, 491.9. And it shows him there on the left as a two-star. And I was thinking, this means that my trophy's been bugged, doesn't it? Because I'd heard of this happening to other people. And they said that when they then taxed that animal and put it in the trophy lodge, it showed all the info for that animal as a two-star. And as you can see, I did that and yeah, it shows him as a two-star. So my five-star moose that I spent all that time watching all that time documenting got ruined by a bug. Now, I am convinced that there's something up with this shot, this supposed first shot, because like I said, I never shot at this moose. I, I have been taking pictures of him and that's it. But the reason I'm convinced something is up with it is look at the bullet. And this is why the bullet cam is so useful. That bullet goes straight through that main artery and then into the intestine. Well, it just barely clips the intestine, but still. Neither the artery or the intestine is listed as having any damage there on the right-hand side. But that bullet goes almost right through the middle of that artery. And it was with the 300. If you hit a moose in the artery with the 300, pretty sure it'll die. I have shot mountain goats. Well, one mountain goat I accidentally shot in this same artery once as it was uh, running past. I took a shot. It was too far back, but it somehow hit the artery. And that animal died within a couple of minutes. So how did this moose somehow apparently survive with one of its main arteries completely ripped to shreds? There's, it doesn't make any sense. And I have discussed this with other people as well. And, you know, they said the same thing. This this shot, if I had taken the shot, should have killed it. So why is it displaying that I took this shot in the bullet cam? Doesn't mention that I've damaged the artery there on the right-hand side. But this moose apparently survived this if I did actually somehow take this shot. Which isn't a shot I would have taken. Like I said, maybe in the smallest percent chance, something like I mentioned before, where it was in a bush behind another animal that I was trying to shoot and somehow I missed and ended up hitting this guy. But I don't, like I said, I don't think that happened. I think something just got majorly bugged here. Maybe info from another animal or just something wild because it's not meant, this is not meant to happen. I did actually speak to one of the community managers for the game and ask if this is a known bug where if you shoot a five star that has apparently been shot once before that it displays all the info for it as a two star but still has the score of the five star but you can't when you tax it it still shows as a two star like rack and stuff in the lodge and it was confirmed to me that that is a bug they are working to fix so I think this whole thing got completely bugged, honestly. And I'm really gutted. I'm absolutely gutted. I went from being so incredibly excited and thrilled to see him as a five star to just being absolutely just... I knew as soon as I saw that it said that I shot it twice, I knew something was wrong. Uh, and just, yeah, it, none of it makes sense. That's why I was taking a look at this bullet cam for quite a while and asking other people, surely if I hit this thing with a 300, which if you shoot a moose in the lungs with the 300, quite often you can, if you're close enough, you can drop them with the 300. Or if you hit them in the right place, you can drop them. Or they'll go a few steps and then die. So it going through a main artery, there's no way it should have survived that. So I think, yeah, the whole thing, unfortunately got very bugged and unfortunately my five star moose is no more at all. I don't have a five star moose in the lodge or anything. But I decided to make this video, like I said, not because I'm trying to bash the game or the devs or anything like that. I love the game. I think the devs are doing a fantastic job and that's why I immediately went and asked if this was a bug that they knew about. They said, yes, we're so sorry. And, you know, we're working on it. Sorry for the, the trouble, the, you know, the inconvenience, basically. 
But yeah, kind of sad. Kind of sad, nevertheless. But at the end of the day, it is a game. And these things do happen. I will continue to manage my moose population as I did until this guy showed up. And hopefully we'll get, you know, maybe maybe one in the same herd that will pop up as like his offspring. Maybe a good genetic one will come from that. Um, there is a young bull in that herd that might be a good one. I'm keeping an eye on it. And there's a couple of other individuals that I'm watching just to see what they sort of turn into. But I will keep going until I end up with one of these things for the lodge. And I am still happy with the experience I had. Getting to document this animal growing up. And, you know, I still got to see him as a five star and shoot a five star. So that was still cool. I, I still got that experience. But it's a big shame that I don't end up having this guy for the trophy lodge. And that the, the harvest screen and everything, it, I don't have any any good record of this being a five star other than really this video so yeah that's kind of why i decided to make it this was going to be sort of like the real main highlight of a highlights video that should have been coming in the next day or so and it really just i couldn't fit all of this info into a highlights video so i decided to make it as its own video but like i said in no way am i trying to say that I'm not enjoying the game or anything like that. I love the game. I will go and get another five star moose eventually, but this was just an unfortunate thing and I wanted to document it because like I said, it's a game, things happen and this was an interesting and odd experience and I didn't want all of the, the images and the time I spent watching this animal. I didn't sort of want that to go to waste because it still was really cool. But that is going to be it for this video. A little bit of a different one, like I said. We'll be really interested to hear what you guys think about this. Especially, um, let me know what you think about that bullet cam showing it go through the artery. Have you shot any animals directly through an artery that have survived? Because I haven't. Everything I've hit through an artery has died. So I still think that that was bugged too. But I'll be really curious to hear what you guys think about that. And what do you think of the five star moose? What do you think of what they look like? I think they look incredible. And yeah, getting to see him grow up, like I said, was still a really cool experience. But that is going to be it for this video. So thank you so, so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.